Hi, my name is Jonesy. Today I'm going to show you how to convert WMA audio to iPhone. Okay, so in order to convert a WMA file on your Mac so that it can play on your iPhone, um, first thing you're going to need to do is to download and install this program called Windows Azure, which you can find at windowsazure.com. Um, you, you can get a free trial for 90 days. Uh, and you definitely need to do this before you try the other process that I'm going to show you. Okay, so once you've done that, you're going to want to go to iTunes. And first thing you should probably do is go to iTunes Preferences. Now, more than likely, if you haven't changed these, are, these are already set correctly. But you want to go to the Import Settings and make sure that Import Using is set to something like the AAC encoder. That's the default, and that's uh, most likely the best encoder you want to use, but if you had accidentally changed it to uh, one of these others, you, you, you probably want to switch it to AAC. So once you've done that, then you go to File and go to Add to Library and choose the file that you want to convert and click Open and it will take care of the rest for you and that's it. So once again, my name is Jonesy and I just showed you how to convert WMA audio to iPhone.